hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl moe and today i'll be doing a very quick face glam so to start off i'm gonna be moisturizing my skin i use the user and sunscreen the one i showed um at the start of the video and then i'm gonna continue with doing my brows So the next thing to do is to conceal the eyebrows. I use the NYX palette, the one in, um, it's an orange color, so it has all the dark colors. And I use a color that looks like my skin on top, and then I use a lighter one at the bottom. Next up, I'm going to be priming my face so my foundation looks better and nice and clear and smooth. So what I use is the Fenty Beauty Primer. It's amazing. You guys should try it. Highlight, I'm still using the LA Pro Concealer in Warm Honey. I haven't tried anything different since this year has passed by. Please recommend any nice concealers if you know them. Yeah, I just go for the T-zone. So it's under the eyes, the forehead, the nose and my chin. So to blend that, I use a beauty blender. I think this is Real Techniques Beauty Blender. It's quite old and you just dab it in. You don't need to like rub it away or anything. Just dab it into the skin. To set my concealer, I use baby powder, like the baby powder that you know. What I love about it is it, it gives a very clean highlight. It looks very light and also it's very matte. And also it doesn't show when you use flashlight or when you take pictures at night. That's one thing I love about the baby powder. But it's also controversial when it comes to like health hazards because Apparently it has talc and if you breathe it in you can get lung CA, lung cancer, but you know, just use it in regulation. The next step is to make the face look, not look darker, but to add color to the skin. You know, I look ashy and too light and all that because I was just highlighting my entire face 
the next thing to do is to add color The next thing I do, I just um, set my concealer with the MAC Dark Deeper Skin Finish. This is to add more color to my skin. I think it's very important to not look ashy in the streets. It's very important. People will be out there looking ashy and stuff and think they're cute. It's not cute. Don't do it. Make sure you have color. Color is very important. Now I'm just adding blush to my cheeks. You know, I'm very minimal with the blush because I just don't understand it, to be honest. Next up, I'll be highlighting my cheeks with the MAC Global Glow. I just put this on the top part of my cheeks, like right above the blush and then on my brow bone as well. That's very important. It gives you a very nice glow and just on the top of my lips and the bridge of my nose and the tip of my nose also. Next up is the second layer of highlight. It's a different highlight. It's the Morphe highlight. I don't actually know the name. I'll link it down below. But it gives a very glowy glow. Like it makes you shine. Like you'll be visible amongst everyone. <laughs> And for the eyeshadow, I love to use a very light concealer so that the colors are more visible. Um, this is called Light Ivory. It's the LA Concealer Pro Concealer. And then I'm using the Morphe Jaclyn palette. It has all the nice shades of browns. So I use a lighter one, a darker one underneath, and the darker one underneath the darker one. And then I use the darkest one on the outer corner of my eye. I'll link the colors down below because <laughs> right now I don't have the palette. But I'll link them down below. And then after that, I cut the crease.
And for the lid, I'm using the Huda Beauty palette, the rose gold as well as the Huda uh, nude palette. So for the lid, I started with the nude palette. I'm using the color, what is it called? I'll link it down below also. And then I use glitters from the rose gold palette. It's called Infatuated. Like the color is just amazing. And then after that, I use the same colors I used on my eye just underneath the eye and The yellow that I used here as well as the pink that I'm using are both from the James Charles Morphe palette. time I'm drawing this eyeliner I don't see that the mirror is actually shading the process so I apologize for that I was gonna show the right one but I actually messed it up big time so there's no need for me to show it yeah I'm really sorry I'm a man of a comedy. 